Hello, beautiful souls. I want to feel your skin against mine. I want to hold you close and never let go. I want to kiss you until we're both breathless. I want to hear your voice. I want to hear you say my name. I want to hear you tell me that you love me. I want to hear you laugh. I can't imagine my life without you. You're my everything. You're the reason I wake up in the morning. You're the reason I work so hard. You're the reason I dream. If I become successful and rich like I want to be, but you're not in my life, it will all mean nothing. I'd be the unluckiest and saddest person on earth. I need you in my life. I love you more than anything in the world. This is a general reading, so take what resonates with you and leave the rest. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next. If you were selected to receive this video today, it means that your guardian angels have a very important message for you. An unexpected apology is on the way, but the catch is that you will need to accept accountability for your part in the conflict. The angels say you must be open to a deep and authentic conversation. Something has happened between you and a friend, lover, or family member. This upcoming conversation is not a light one. It's with someone you've known for a long time. You share a bond together, you've journeyed together, grown, evolved, shared, and bonded in many ways on multiple planes. This bond could possibly be a lifelong friendship or soulmate connection, and this person wants to apologize to you. But it won't be one-sided. They expect a real conversation with balance and unity as the two main goals. The message is to be open-minded, keep diplomacy, mediation, and harmony as your affirmations and intentions. These are essential for things to go smoothly. Moreover, for the connection to be maintained. This is not an ambush by any means. The catch doesn't have to be seen as negative. It's not a deceptive tactic to manipulate or control you, nor are there hidden motivations to gain something from you either emotionally or materially. This person's intentions for reconciliation are sincere, but you do need to be aware of your own triggers and blocks of harmony. We all have them. It's easy to assume others are cold, mean-spirited, or useless at working on their shadows. However, in truth, if everyone is a mirror of us, a divine reflection, it is we who can unconsciously project and even cause drama or destruction. I repeat, an unexpected apology is on the way, but the catch is that you will need to accept accountability for your part in the conflict. Have you been denying your words, actions or intentions? Oh yes, intentions can ripple out to affect physical reality. You may not need to say anything or create something to happen or not happen through physical actions. Sometimes your will and continued projected thoughts are enough. From Divine Muscular Type yes if you believe.